Ben's got this here to build. Old super trowel's on the trowel today, look. He's got, uh, he's just finishing off that little corner over here. So I finish that little corner here. Uh, Amy is gonna be finishing off a little bit she's got here, look. Uh, and Harry's on the hod today. Um, I've got this little bit here to take up, same as I've done there. Um, then we'll just jump on here, whack this block work up six, uh, and then back it up with brick work. And then after that, all's done. Whether it's done today or not, we'll get jumping up there next to finish the gable ends. Hey, getting on, Liam. Um, all I'll say is, I know you've done a lot of footings, so you won't be used to it, but you've got your frame tags to put in. Oh, this, yeah. And every course, you've got your, cor uh, you've got your wall, tie. wall tie every course on this, yeah? yeah? So your wall ties go in here, look, this way and this way, yeah? yeah? 100 mil in, out the, 100 mil in from here, look, yeah. this way, and then 100 mil in this way. Uh, you need to make sure, so when you put this frame tag in, look, you hook it in and that's what holds it tight to your block work, yeah? yeah. All right. And if it seems to keep wanting to pull away like it is, yeah, what you need to do is get yourself, uh, I don't know, maybe a bit of chip brick or something. Uh, that'll probably do it. And it'll just, no, that ain't, hang on. Go in there. Hang on. Tuck it in the brickwork because the brickwork's gone off. Yeah. You tuck it in there, look. So that's nice and tight. Um, yeah. Make sure, make sure you get at least uh, one in, another one in. Wall tie in every one, yeah. Uh, don't forget, Amy. Amy, yeah. you've missed your snots on the last course. So when you're done, you ain't gonna get it from up there now. When you're done, come around the back of here and just get something in here. Maybe a light stick or something, and just. Was it just a one course I forgot? Did I forget him yesterday? Mm, yeah, you forgot him yesterday, but you'll get it. We can get it, but it's just good practice to try and get them as you go. Yeah. Is that something you, that just comes to you to remember? Eventually? What snots? Yeah, but a lot of bricklayers get they'll get their snots up to where they can see them, and then they they'll either just can't be bothered and just not snot knock on the next lift, but it just takes a lot longer. That's it there, and a hundred mil in. So basically, in line with that, that way, yeah. Every course they go on this site. That's it. Right. Sorry. Yeah, pass them here. I'll poke them in. Oh, you've done it. Yeah. Right. I'll poke one in here for you. All right. All right. Where was I? So, I show a lot of you how to do profiles and stuff. I don't really show anything about building freehand. So, I'm going to do this plot freehand. We didn't do the substructures, so the best way to check when you're doing it freehand that everything's cutting right. Yeah? Could you just cut this bit off for me? Because I'll end up breaking the whole block. It's just a little bit. Just a little bit. All right. Thank you. No problem. What's I saying? Yeah, so the best way to check that 
the uh, their work, who, whoever done the work below, is cutting right, is to build a small corner. When I say a small corner, I literally mean like a free high corner because um, because you don't know if they're called line layers uh, they're, they're people that lay on the line and don't realize they're doing it uh, and they pull the wall out so by the middle they're about 10 15 mil out and they have a slight curve not nothing you can see to your eye but if they are so basically harry we've got some 100 mil damp please mate so we'll bed our damp on always bed your damp on this is another thing a lot of a lot of bricklayers cut corners in all sorts of way and another way that they cut corners is because they can't be asked to bed the damp on properly so literally all i'll do is bed this on you want you want to be about 10 well five mil back from the face of the brickwork just so it's not showing uh, i'm only doing a small corner to start with so i can add to that as long as you overlap it over 100 mil i go about 150 build a corner it is literally my first one is the one I gauge a lot of bricklayers will lay the whole bed out that way whole bed out that way run it run it and then level it and then check it for gauge after but me personally to check you've got a good face either side I lay I've laid these bricks for a little while now so I think I roughly know where I need to lay it to but I'll just double check it I've got my tape here it's just a quick Come down to here, all right, I'm 80 mil there, because I've got that, because I've got the damp down with a bed, it's a little bit, so 75 there, I'll eye it down first, I'll try and get it to where it should be, uh, I haven't even got a level out yet. <laughs> plumb right on this corner right on the edge so that you so that your level is literally there so it's flush off of there now that that this is their work that I'm plumbing off I'm hoping that my camera's showing that so the only way to start now is to level from this point up here which is a pain in the ass because you've got to balance it a bit better but that is level there and we plumb there. Now, I only want a free high corner, so I've literally, I've got to go out one brick one way and two the other. little bit wet for building corners but that looks like they're big works all over the shop already and I've only laid a few bricks so now you want to range it I use my put the back of my leg to just put it onto the brickwork now this is their brickwork here look this is this is what I'm coming off of look yeah so now I'm just trying to 
miss this brickwork and just clip the top of this point here just to straighten it up a bit all right now next course same again we'll check it face side face side check it for a gauge 50 yes finished right let's go and have a look you got a problem what you got a gap well that there you should have perped it but you can fill it up yeah you've got a hole there look and then just help harry get it all tidy i've got to get us set up for the next wall all right Oh, check it. Yeah, I did. With my eye. <laughs> Looks good to me. No, it's not. It's that top. Just, just, oh, no, that's a bit of muck. Hang on. No, it's just this top bit. It's just leaning over ever so slightly. When you're levelling, right, a lot of people look at it from here, like this, and it looks good. But if you put your head against the wall... I tried to do yeah, that. Yeah, put, put your head against the wall and tell me if you think it's spot, spot on. No. No? Oh, well, I really thought I got it. It's not, it's not bad. It's literally minimal. It's not a lot. Not look, 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 that was it. You just needed that little tap. And then you want to range it through the top, look, like that. Yeah? You only check, check that bit. Please. <laughs> it's good. Is it? Yeah. What, it's bang on? <laughs> not bang on, but it's like about two mil out. Which is better than most bricklayers could do. <laughs> Yes, mate. No. <laughs> that you've straight jointed it. Yeah? Oh, right. See, so we've got see to break what, that in half. Yes, yeah, no, so what you've done is, right, see this here, mm -hmm. this cut, that should have been a cut. Yeah? You're copying oh, this so that course. Should that there. should have run over there. This see. this Cellcom block should have gone over and tied this perp to the, that this should be laid. 100 mil over yeah. so that this perp is there on right. this briquette yeah, yeah, yeah. So just take that off move that across it's, it, and you're you're about from here it looks you're a little bit low look yeah you want to be bang on to that up there yeah all right, all right. level it across the top Range it through the front. Check it for plumb. Now, I'm going from the top of their work. This is why I had to trim the back of my bricks off even though on the other plot i had to trim the back of my bricks at the uh, door frames because they've obviously got a line layer who lays on the line and pulls the line out so when you string the line over the top that's why i've ended up having to cut them right lay this last one oh dry brick fuck me where are you walking out from yeah you're right no, glad, isn't it? <laughs> no he fucking just takes forever doesn't he you, uh, you sorry no what's he like he's alright I did that is he, he alright is he yeah. Yeah. Sausage rolls. <laughs> oh, I slipped a few quid. <laughs> All right, two, two, five. Oh, 
He's what? Yeah, I know, it's mental, isn't it? Are you even allowed to do that? Security for silence. Oh, right, I got you. Right. Really right. Is he really? Is he, he's not an arsehole then? He can be. Oh, right, he can. Have you met? Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, I'm, good, I'm good at getting on with forkies. That's just, you got to get on with a forklift driver. Oh, yeah, it's the friend here with your fucking sweet, isn't it? Yeah, mate. Right, we're nice and plumb. Now, what, 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 how do we check it? How do we check it? It's all of these Amy's is I've got my eyes set lines up um, so my toolbox tool bags over here is me telling them to bring the tools over look and I didn't do it myself it hasn't got to be pulled mega tight because you've only just built a little small corner so it's a line. you're all right huh giving it to what saying what Oh fucking hell. Loves it, doesn't he? <laughs> uh it, yeah I know. <laughs> you meant it already. Right. Now this is how you check that the work below is good to go off of, which by the looks of it, <laughs> it ain't great. Right, I've got a lot of set of lines going through here, just yeah, so, just be right. careful mate. So we'll pull it. Down to this end. Hasn't got to be mega tight because I'm only using it to range my brickwork. I'm not using it to pull off of, to, to level off of. I'm just using it to plumb off of, plumb my work off of. So I'm hooking it on this corner. Right now, let's have a look. It cuts right. But that isn't actually too bad if I'm honest. That's pretty good. So now, this is my plumb point here. So I want to make sure nothing's catching. I'm going to tap this in a touch. All right. Now I'm going to pull off of this line, but I'm not going to lay to it. I'm just using it as, oh, 450 damp, 675 Can I have two wheat vents please, Harry? Yeah. So all these plots are the same. We've got this actually no, sorry. Uh, this in particular one, uh, this these two are handed, I think. Ten eleven. We want eleven and uh, 12 and 13. 12 and 13. Uh, yeah, but if you set yourself up right, it runs pretty smooth, do you know what I mean? It's, we'd all like garden walls all day, every day, but... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Third lift's my favourite lift. lift. Everything's set out and you just profiles up and you're running in. <laughs> These can't be too bad sites for you, really. I suppose he's on both on price, yeah? Yeah, it must be good earners, these ones. Uh, yeah, it is really good. Like, if you had this whole, the whole yeah, I know. Once it kicks off, you'll be all right, wouldn't you? Yeah. Sorry, Harry, did you say something, mate? Yeah, just around that. Oh, right. Uh, they're going to be doing block work first, mate. Are you coming out here, though? 
Ah. Huh? I'm going to be building corners. Yeah. yeah. So I'm not laying down to this line. I'm just using it to stay a couple of mil back from. Are you going to be building corners inside on the Yep, I'm going to literally, I'm building a little corner here, then I'm going to build a little corner here, do the same the other end, and then when they're Oh, they're going to be building, uh, well, one of them is going to be building this yeah, brickwork. Yeah, and Amy's probably just going to be, once I've got a couple of little corners up, she can run a bit of uh, block working. Yeah, mate. A bit of batten? Bit of batten? Uh, no. There should be a bit round somewhere. I'm sure there was a bit somewhere. I honestly couldn't tell you. There's a little bit in that cavity there, look. So you want to cut this off here, look. That looks like heavy, man. Now I can... Let me level across the top. Tap that down. Everyone's, you know, there's a lot of people out there that say don't hit your level, but there's nothing wrong with just giving it a little tap with the heel of your trail. I don't fucking think so anyway. It's much faster than trying to figure out every brick that needs tapping in fucking, or meet an 91, meet an 91, meet an 91, meter 91. So we've got a meter 91, which was, you're lining up this door reveal here with the measurement there, look. So then you've got from the edge of your brickwork, there, from there to there, one meter and 91 mil, which is one meter 91 is there. up on the next one. I can't tighten them up though because I've got these vents in and this and it makes my perp big. You can't get them any tighter than that and that's about 15 mil that perp. The only one I can tighten up is that and move that that way so I'm still going to end up with a cut. What are you doing? You will be once I get a little corner up, but until then, I just want you to, it's, I just need you for about an hour just to help Harry out. And then once I've got a couple of corners up, you can run in, yeah? yeah. Or you can, you can have a go at that brickwork if you feel confident enough. You can have a go. It's a little bit tricky. Just do one course, give me a shout. Do one course, give me a shout. Do that anyway. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know. You're all right. You're all right. You're doing well. Uh, so. I mean, if you want to do this. I'm, I'm not doing it. I was going to leave it for one of you two to do. But it's, you know, you've got to be very neat. What? Do you want to have a go at it? Can I Feel go? confident? No, have a go at it. If you if you can't get it, if you can't quite get it yet, then I'll let uh, Liam have a go. But you've got to put the line up there, line up there. Yeah. Get uh, Amy a bit of muck here, mate. Get your tools over there, then. I always want to let. I know you do. Brickwork's a bit hard, though. No. Right. Yep. If I can't do it, then I'll just won't do it. Alright, so. Meter 91. It's about there. I 
meter 91 is there so we have got a 190 cut 190 let me bolster Fucking hell! You're all using them now, so technically you've nicked them. Ah, huh? take them off then. Put your own on then. Give them in back. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> right. Right now, I'll do it again. Same again. Line up. No, but you got to give it a go. <laughs> yeah, I do trust you. <laughs> you can't, but I can't bother you. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know what you mean. <laughs> right, let's see if I can get it on this one. If I can't nice tight bed perhaps I'll have to do a cut yeah yeah <laughs> what do you think I was talking to you <laughs> oh, I thought I was talking under my breath <laughs> oh funny right Nah, I'm definitely going to have a cut. I'll open them up a touch because um, I need to... I've got the, the, the best best um, three quarter with these bricks to cut is a 185. Because of the circle in the middle and how they break, you don't want to be trying to cut it here or in here. It's, it's best around in the centre somewhere. But the bigger the three quarter, the better. we're going for mm. this way I like to put uh, my cut end facing that way uh, I don't like putting a cut against the cut you know sometimes you forget but So put the level on the top. 
nice and level. Now, if I, now that I've plumbed that end and pulled it from that way, if I was to actually stick my level on it, it's actually leaning in a touch. But I now know that I've got a true, true, true pull, a true straight line, yeah? See, what you don't want to do is pull off of the level off of their work from here, plumb off of their work from here. If their work kicked out, that means you're going to plumb from a kicked out point. And when you pull a line, this line is now going to go like that. Let's say, let's say, for instance, they've pulled it through and they've laid right on the line and they've pulled it out 15 mil, say, like that. Then if you plumb off of their work and that pulls your line out like that, now you've got a kick in the line. Now, what, that's not a problem until you get onto the um, second lift when, when you finish up to your um, windows, uh, uh, head of, when you finish up to your head of frame and then you have to pull straight over the top. And then what will happen is you'll go to pull through and your line will go from doing that to kicking straight in and then, you'll, and then your brickwork will do that over the window and then you'll have to tingle it out and so if you get yourself a true line to start with, you won't have any problem. It takes a little bit of time, but it's worth it in the long run. All right, Amy, Amy. Wait, wait, nothing, you've done nothing wrong. Uh, I'm trying to, yeah. Yeah, I'll lay your bed. Look, watch, 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 watch me, watch me. Nice, thick bed, yeah. Lay it the whole way through. All right? I know, but I'm teaching you it this way because the muck's a little bit wet. Yeah. You're jumping on here with her, Liam. Just help each other out. Right, the first one you lay, yeah, is this middle one. Yeah. Yeah, and I personally, Push right, together. hold it like that, yeah. Do this. So it's, I don't. I don't want to squeeze muck in, yeah, and then have muck against that. You want, you want it to be, so you've got no muck against these, yeah. and nice and flush to that, yeah. so it looks nice and pretty to the eye, yeah? So you're going in, and you're sliding it down, right? So we're going, now, obviously that's about to fold over, so you don't want it bending over and going onto the face of the brick, which has slightly. All right. You lay that one, yeah? Now, you want like a little tie in there, like that. It's your plumb point. Yeah, so you're getting, and then you've got to plumb it, like that. Yeah, make sure you plumb. Adjust that to suit. I want to do it every course, yeah? All right? Yeah. And then, once that's done, what are you not, what are you not understanding? Plumb what? You need this movement joint here. This is a movement joint. You need it to be absolutely bang on the whole way up, yeah? Mm -hmm. Now, the only way to do that is to level plumb from this point. So. Which side? Uh, it doesn't matter which side, as long as you stick to the same side, yeah? So. For some reason, I always go on the right-hand side. Um, so I'm putting my level at the flush with this this side of the brick, yeah? yeah. All right, we're going level there. And then we're plumbing it up. Checking, you got to, uh, it's good to have this here so it stops it from moving, yeah? So if you hold it like that, hold yeah. that and hold that, yeah, it gives you like a swing point. So you won't accidentally move it and then plumb it and then think I'm miles out, all right? So we're plumbing up, like that, yeah? Yeah. And then they're right, so then you can do this little bit here. What's right? Ow! Oh, the brick. The bricks are right, in the right place. Now now that they're right, you can finish, yeah? But get your whole bed out first. But you're very high in the line here. Here, watch out, I ain't finished yet. How come you can tell me my bricks are wrong, but... <laughs> yeah. Right, look, look at this, look, look. What's happening? Do you know what's happening there? The back. The back's what? I've pushed down at the front and not the back. Right, so that's why you've got that, right? 
I don't like Brick Perch. Right, it's, no one likes it to start with because if everyone could do it, Amy, everyone would be doing it, wouldn't they? Yeah. I don't care if you lay one and he lays fucking the rest. Just, yeah. Shout me if you're not sure. And every six, right? Every six, Liam. Yeah. Right. All you got to do, I'll just show you on this one. It doesn't. Just pierce a hole. Oh, for. Uh... And grab a. Amy, grab us a thing there. No, 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 no. That's it. Just goes in like that. Oh yeah, every yeah. six. Every six. Yeah. So just on like there, it would have been there, and then there, and then there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Just take your times with it and get it right. Yeah. Just give me a shout if it just don't feel right. Yeah. Right, so uh, where was we? Level and across. Right, so level to gauge. Come up the reveal. Like that. Now, when I do, um, when I build corners. I like to do it in two passes. So I'll do, I'll go six out, that'll get me 12 high. I'll go, so I'll go six from this way out, and that'll get me 12 courses of brickwork high. Yeah. And then we'll run it in, and that'll leave me, and then and I'll do the same again, six out, and it will give me, and then, uh, not six out, five out, and that'll get me up to, uh, what's that, 12. That'll get me 22, but I'm only going 20, so I only need to go five, but I'm gonna go six anyway. Well, now I've done it that way, and I know that's right. I can now do it the same as what I've done, but this way. Harry, do us a favour, mate. Grab that corner block over there and hook it down that end over there. You don't want to be winding it all up when you can just get someone just to take it. Straight. Just lift it up over and keep it tight. Keep it tight, that's it. Cheers, mate. Just hook it on that corner. Don't be hitting that with your blade. Uh, that'll do, that'll do. All right, again, don't need to be mega tight. Just tight enough to get a reading off. Now, already I can see that this has kicked. You want it to bounce. You want that line to bounce without it. Without if it if it bounces and then stops, it's catching something, which ain't ain't good. Um, right, one, two, three, four, five, six is there. overlap of at least 100 mil cut five mil back from the line from the face of the brickwork Gives a shout every couple of courses, Liam. Just so I can check it. Right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now I've got massive perks here. Put my light down this end. Now they're getting tighter, tighter. They're all over the shop. So if I was to double check their gauge of brickwork you'd be every 
if you're hooking off of a brick, you'll be 890 to there. So already, if I go 890, 900 would be the other side from there. So if I actually, if you look at their brickwork here, look, you can see I'm about 30 mil back here. So I'm just going to double check their their brickwork gauge. So we've got 27. Yeah, so one of the people in this gang obviously pulls the work their way. 50, 63 would be next, which is there. Seventy, sixty, eighteen. 18. Yeah, so that is bang on to the tape, um, but they haven't. I don't think they've used the tape to so I'm gonna I'm gonna change what they've done below so I've got even perps the whole way through always always gauge your brickwork always uh, so we've got a big perp there but so I've actually there 1350 it's actually 13 4 15 30, 30. I don't want to put it too much off of theirs right so that is six bricks out their work below and go half on to what I just done. See that line's bouncing? It means I'm not touching it. But you want to be as close as you can. Is that it? Do you want me to come and have a look? Yeah, Alright. Right. 
Oh, as well. Fucking Harry, just uh, for when we run this brickwork in, stick two bricks like that, and it will stop any muck going against the brickwork we've done, yeah? So now I know everything's running right, I can now set my block work up. Uh, just chuck us a couple of shovelfuls on there, please. Right, yes, mate. Just chuck a bucket on there, mate. So we want this out the way. Sorry? Have you done a couple of you? Done one. Done one, do another one. Yeah, I'll have a quick look. Just a little bit low, not a lot, just a little bit low on that one. Apart from that, it's pretty good. The only thing I'll say is it's a little bit holy. Yeah? Just a little bit holy, Liam. But apart from that, they're laid right, so it'll look right when it's jointed, but yeah. it's just holy, all right? Uh, what I'm doing is uh, I'm going to lay a course in here and, and a few blocks out that way. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to take my block work corner up a few Word. and then I'm going to do this corner uh, up to 12 high here Word. and then I'm going to do the same the other end. Yeah. yeah. And then that gives us something to run in. Yeah. So, yeah, I'll, I'm basically going to be building my block work corner up for a bit. So, yeah. when I need a bit of muck to take it off these ones, yeah, yeah that's the one. Alright, let's get this block work the corner set up. Six high corner. Um, with block work, you need to go out three blocks, which will be one, two, three, that'll be about there. Now, to do that, no, oh, you tosser. Have we got any more 100 mil damp? Harry? Oh, do I have one have, yeah, go get a few rolls. We're gonna need, uh, bring them all over. Yeah, and you're gonna need at least four or five. All right, so. Go for block laid this way first. Overkill on the damp, but that's what they want. Some sites are a lot worse for damp. This ain't too bad actually. So we'll go full block this way. Not so. Now the best thing to do is. Measure 
because I've got my free courses, I can now measure overall, because that's what you want overall, which that is 127. That is going to be very tight for the frame, but let's make 330. 330. That's good enough there. Now, just cut. So we had 1091. 1091's about there. So that'll be about. Is there none in there? There's some in the wheelbarrow, so I have to separate it out of the wheelbarrow. Uh, you just bring that fucking wheelbarrow over if you can. Yeah? Yeah, we'd have to. Uh, they're, they're, they're bringing a lot more stuff over. We'll do that to 225 to start. 225. Now, because it's over 150 mil, they usually snap pretty well if you just score them these cell cons so just a quick snap like that all right so now I go because I've Done 10, well I've gone to 1095 there, it's not a problem. So we'll go 1095 there, we'll go 330 at the bottom, 330 at the top. All right, done another course. What's that line a sec, Liam? Every one of them's right, apart from one, which is millimetres out. Just this one. Just come down to your knees a little bit, Aim, yeah. and just just come down to to the to the line level. Yeah. yeah. All right, but they're all good, apart from that one, which I'm not even joking. That isn't even that bad. It's just me being very picky. All right. They're, they're going into the wall now, yeah? Yeah, but why is it bent like that? Why is it bent like that? So, they're, so I didn't keep catching them. Yeah, and I bend them sideways because it's easier just to bend it back. Then if you bend it up, then when you try and bend it down, it still stays up, you see? That's so, so that, yeah, but not as bad as that one, yeah? Right. So, we'll go. Full block. Now I am, I can already tell that I'm very high to start with to the outside so I'm going to have to grind this block work a little bit 330 330 can you do me a favour get that corner block uh, actually don't worry I've got to sort something out here yeah no worries right so now how to pull a I do the same as what I do with a brickwork so what I'll do is I'll measure 330, like that. And the line ain't too tight, so it should be all right. I'm not gonna, just in case. Uh, I'll hook it on there, like that. Now we'll measure 330. That block work's just gone out of touch. There, again, 330. 330, 330, 331. So you get a back from that line. Now, just go back down this end, check that that line's good. This shit's catching on here a little bit.
So I'm just showing you how to do it free, completely freehand. No profiles, no clamps, no nothing. So to get your corner six high, you're going out three blocks. I'm eyeing it down at the end because I can I can pretty much tell where it is going to be level without having to level it. But just for argument's sake, you want to get a little boat level, which I don't know where mine's gone. to move slightly so now I know I've got two corners that I can plumb off of that are spot on just line back out out of the way so I like to do full block there full block there so now uh, the cut to go half bond would be uh, the blocks are 620 so they are 310 to go half bond but you want the 310 in the middle of the perp mark it measure over you've got 425 425 now that is again that is a 200 cut so we're good to score it it should it usually works it doesn't work every time but it's quite quick if it does work Work that time. Now we've got wall tires this course, which are uh, he brought a load over. He's got to sort them out though. Alright, have to sort these out at some point. It'll be on a rainy day, I reckon. Uh, 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 uh. Careful, look, look what you've done there, look. Oh, yeah. And that wouldn't have been no good either because you've got to make, when you're cutting a half, look, mm -hmm. right, it needs to be at the most that at the least about 90 mil. Right. All right. Oh, Amy. Amy, Amy, uh, I'll have to change it. We won't change it yet. Be careful, look. See that? Smooth side, face side. Look, watch. Look at this brick. Face side. Smooth side, no good. I can change that later, so just leave it for now. All right. So on this side, they want them there and there, every course, and then every 750. So that would be about there and about there. Um, on this one, I'd do up the reveal every course and up the corner every course. But I need to put this damp on first. So where is... Oh no. Oh, you're joking. I just fell out. So, 
was we now on this side they like it 225 back which is a brick which is about there now as well you're governed by the floor so I can I feel like I've already bumped up quite substantially just off of their first bit of brickwork so I am 235 so I'm 10 mil high to gauge already which is why my brickwork I'm already 15 mil high to so I know that I've got a great um, 15 mil hot so yeah I've got to bump the brickwork up 5 mil to get to this floor um, hang on when I'm laying a block when I'm at this height I don't look at the front I lean over the back and I'll tap, tap it down pick the back up first make sure I'm line up uh, you only laid two bricks do the next course and I'll check that so I'm plumbing I pulled it I didn't level these blocks but I know that the top was pulled into the line so I'm just going to level off the top plumb off the top sorry I personally don't fuck about most of the time V-ing beds out and stuff with Cellcons because as soon as you put this muck on a Cellcon it's getting the life sucked out of it. I personally like to just chuck, chuck a bit of muck out, just enough so that when I push it down it doesn't go everywhere. So just a thin bed doesn't have to be all touching sides because it's flat on flat pushing down it will, the, the block work will push itself out all right just double check these measurements 750 is there oh 750 is, oh 750 is there this muck seems to be dead no life in it don't need to play. It's the only trouble with um, some silos. The muck comes out. It's diabolical. It's knocked up so quick. It's just had no time to fluff up a bit. And I love mixer muck, but it is convenient just pressing a button for the hog carriers. All right, so. level across the top oh that's quite far out so I'm not going to take it back up because I know that I'll just put a bit more of a bed on on the next one it's good there it's good there right, we've got a little cut here so we've got 120 Sorry, it's 145, so I'll do it at 120. Turn it over, top, go through the back of it, top, and then through the front. Keep hitting until it comes off. Now, it ain't broke quite right, so just a little touch up. We hammer.
whenever you're laying blocks um, and you, you, you haven't done the brickwork first, you've got to remember wall ties, so it'll be muck first. Just always get in your head, the last thing you do is lay the block. So we're doing a muck, then we're getting a... Do you want me to come check? Yes, yeah, then we're doing the wall ties. Then we're laying the block. The block is the last thing you want to think about putting on the wall. Always check for frame tags, wall ties. Because <laughs> I'm uh, showing them how to do it, showing people how to make a good job with it, with doing it freehand. Oh, what a nightmare. <laughs> huh? I fucking turned it the wrong way to come out. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> a bit out of practice, isn't ya? Yeah. Oh. All right. I'll... Harry, let me check. Uh, Liam, let me check the next one. Yeah. Amy did ask me to come check it, but right. So cut is. Uh, too far. He makes sure it fits easy. I give it 15 mil perps when I'm doing cuts. It gives you a bit more play. On this side, they don't like to see it snapped. Um, like a lot of people will just keep whacking this side and it might break off at an angle like that. And they do not like to see that on this side. So that's why we've got to flip it. I do like using the skill saw, but I seem to keep getting a sore throat. Um, I seem to get, keep getting a sore throat, even with a mask on. So I don't know if I need a better mask or what, but yeah, I wasn't too happy with how sore my throat was on Monday. Harry, you know all the door frames and stuff that you got before? Yeah. You gotta do that again, mate. Uh, yeah, same they're all the same, yeah, exactly the same, yeah. Do you remember them or do you wanna write them down? Uh, I'll text you my dolphin room, right? So it's still on the Oh, you got, got them, have you got a nice one? Oh, well done. Yes, yeah, so just get, get a bit of muck out. Uh, I don't need them right this second. Maybe even if we get them after break. break yeah, yeah? save you walking down there again. It's quarter past nine, mate. On the on the block work, mate.
gonna finish this corner, finish that corner, and then I wanna get some music on. <laughs> Harry got us still the window frames and door frames. So now what I've done is made sure this area here is nice and clean, right? Because you want the bottom of this to sit absolutely flush. Now Obviously, so this plot's handed, which means they give you this drawing this way, but it's actually flipped that way. Um, uh, a lot of people struggle at the tops because they don't um, make their life easy from the bottom. So I've got a 900 by 460 window on this side. So to make that bang on, um, even though it tells you it's a 900 window, actually get the actual window and actually check because sometimes they come up 10 mil big and if you build a gauge then put this on your brickwork to gauge then what happens is this bumps up 10 mil so then you're going to be slightly high with one of these frames to the other so if i measure this i mean you see so that's 905 so now I'll just measure down 905, which is there, 905, and the other window that we've got is a, one meter 135 is the width, because it's got it here, look, the width. So that means the depth is 1050. So even though it said 1050, I'll go get the window and just check that it is 1050. Probably five to 10 mil bigger. So that is 1053. So let's say 1055. So you've got 10.55 is there. So now my gauge to get to that mark is 8.20. So I've got to grind five mil there when I get to this height. And then that window will be sitting that side. And then in between this one, I've got 150 bang on so i ain't got nothing to worry about there and then from there to there i've got 905 so i've got to bump five mil from there to there but so if i just go now i've got that mark from my windows if i just go Now I've got my gauge marks. You know, from there to there. 75. And then from here, I'd so can't really see, but there you go, 75, 150, 225, 300, 300, Seven five, seven fifty, eight two five. Yeah. So once I get to this height, I've probably got to then bump, start bumping. But you wouldn't do it in one go. You'd do it over a few courses. It takes a little bit of time doing all this, but 
what happens is a lot of people go to gauge and then they realize they've got a bump 20 mil at the top um, and it just don't look pretty uh, before you do your next course yeah. you got a little boat level I have, yeah. yeah you got boat level stick your boat level across the top the smallest level you got yeah that's it just stick your level on the top you can use that one that's good enough all right just stick your level across the top yeah so look so so yeah but you've laid it wait don't pull it out because you've laid the top to the line so it's the bottom that needs to be adjusted now for it to do that you need to hit the bottom this this way yeah so look watch yeah okay and then just double check that you're not on the line still and a quick check so it's still all right yeah and just go through checking them okay thank you no problem I think I've pushed that brickwork out. Come on, level. Yeah, 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 they're fine. I'll look down the line. Oh. Level over there, that. Fucking, I need a fucking magnetic hole for me level, I think. What size was that cut? 185. enough for one block at a time Liam it goes off like fucking quick as fuck on these blocks yeah I'll just yeah. use it mate couldn't bring me over a dry hot of bricks so these are a little bit wet if you're gonna bring me wet mark I need a bit dry bricks Got a 
grind a bit, but I'm not going to do it in one go. Um, just do a little bit of recording and then uh, we'll stick it back on. When's your new uh, it should be delivered soon. When? Soon. Okay. This <laughs> should be soon. Range it through. Socks. Yeah. 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 What's the matter? I can't do the little ones. You've got to try or... I'll br keep breaking the box. Uh, I've got a block saw. Liam can cut it with a block saw. If you can't, if you can't do it with a hammer and bow, so just use a block saw, yeah? I like to plumb my first one up rather than run the whole course in and plumb them all up because that way 
um, when I lay my other bricks. So now that I've plumbed it, this point is plumb. So now when I lay the bricks up to it, I sort of use it as a guide for all the rest that I lay. All right, hard. Every 7.50, well done. Bless you. Yeah, that's good. So don't forget your snots, yeah? If you're to that line, hey. if you're to the line, yeah. right? If, if it's leaning out slightly, if it, if it needs tapping over, yeah. because it's out of plumb, right? It's the bottom that needs to be adjusted. Right, right? So, so what I'm saying is, yeah, Let's have a look. That's all. Hang on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, what was that? In other words, don't touch my level. <laughs> <laughs> don't touch her level for fuck's sake, Liam. She'll fucking come at you. <laughs> Oh, all right. <laughs> yeah. Is that blue one I brought over was still a bit wet? What one? What? The second one I brought over. Just a tad, but nothing, it, it won't. You'll be all right with it? I'll be all right. I'd rather it was nice and creamy for them. I'll, I'll yeah. just go a bit slower on the corners. Dropped a lot of muck there, which means you got way too much muck out. Look, if you uh, if you uh, if you're gonna not bother veeing it out, yeah. right? You need to make sure your angle that you're t picking up, yeah, yeah, is a lot, yeah. So you don't know it need no, and also when you do that on the back, yeah, try to pick it up, yeah, and not scrape it like that because that's what chucks a load of muck down the cavity, yeah. Right.
Use what? Uh, as long as the, yeah, just stick the back, bad bit at the back into the into the uh, cavity, yeah? decided it's wanted to piss down but we got literally just got the day in it's absolutely pissing down now um, I built some small corners they run in uh, for the five course um, while they was running that in I literally took the corners up took this up freehand wrapped a little corner up wrapped a corner up that end I, lit, I helped them finish the last three or four courses um, just to use a muck up quick and uh, yeah we're back on here tomorrow um, what we're going to do is they're going to help me run two courses these two courses into the line tomorrow um, and then while they're running this four course in I'm going to chuck these uh, last of these corners up and uh, yeah that's it I'll just show you Amy and Amy's and uh, Liam's here they built while I was building the corners. It's Amy's little pier. I don't think she's done too bad of a job. And Liam's. 
Not bad job at all. 